What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Nichols YouTube channel. So today is the last day of playing Rogue decks uh, for Rogue Tuesday week. Uh, we're ending the week off with a double whammy kind of special. It is Bayonet EX with Spide Ops EX. Now, unfortunately, I can't remember where I got the original concept from, and I apologize. I saw it on Twitter, and I was like, "Yo, that looks so sick. Let's let's test it out." And we did. Uh, we made. I I know I made changes to it. I just don't remember how many changes I made uh, to the list. Uh, but the idea is pretty cool. Please, and if, if you made this list, please let me know. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Uh, but Bay 90 X has Everlasting Darkness. It does 30 damage, and during your opponent's next turn, they can't play item cards from their hand. And that is a big deal. Item cards are everywhere in this format. Uh, you got Love Ball, you, uh, Love Ball, uh, you got Nest Ball, Ultra Ball, Rare Candy, uh, anything like that that can, you know, really help set up. That You can't play those, uh, which is great. And the big thing is you can't play Switch. And that is a big deal because we have cards like good old Spide Ops EX. It has the ability to trap territory, making where your opponent that Pokemon retreat calls is one more. And so the point of today's video is to actually deck out your opponent, really. That's what we're really going to try to do here is deck out your opponent, right? Um, yes, you could technically like Everlasting Darkness and make it where they can't set up, and then you can pull your guys and stuff like that. But then there's like take a knockout back to you or whatever. Um, so I think Everlasting Darkness is where it's at. I guess you could, like, Everlasting Darkness and the Poltergeist, and fingers crossed they can't one-shot you, and then you go back to an Everlasting Darkness, but we're not going to try that play. We're going to try to go for decking out our opponent, and the way we're going to do this is we're going to use Boss Order. We're going to bring a Pokemon from the bench to the active, get a stuck of Spider PX because they can't retreat because they need a lot of energies, and we're going to use Bayonet where they can't play Switch or Escape Rope or Switch Cart or anything like that. And so that is the point of the deck. Uh, there's still Shuppet, which has M... M Enveloping, envo I don't know how to say this word. Why am I struggling? In, in, enveloping? In, I don't know. Enveloping? I don't know. I'm gonna, you, You're going to say, be like, Josh, what are you talking about? I'm like, I don't know. Does 10, and your opponent's, uh, if you flip the point, if heads, they can't put item cards from their hand. And the regular Tarantula, um, not regular, but the full art kind of combo. I like this little artwork they got going on with Spotty. I was in, in Tarant Tarantula, uh, which has Scythe in the middle. So that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool combo. And a 1-1 one, one B-Barrel. Now, B-Barrel's in here because we want to be able to draw cards plus play other effects. And, of course, we'll go over that. Uh, 4 Nest Ball, 4 Ultra Ball, Max Book Consistency to find a po Pokemon get set up. But 2 Capture Roam, flip the coin of heads, search for an evolution. If Tails, find a base Pokemon. Either one should be fine. Horror Crush Hammer, so you make it where your opponent can't retreat. Even more. 1 Echoing Horn. If they discard a Pokemon, you can bring it back from the bench, uh, from the discard problem to the bench, and then boss it up. 2 Pal Pad to get supporter cards back into your deck. Four picnic baskets. Now the thing about Bayonet EX is they we do thirty damage, and so what we're trying to counter that is picnic basket where we heal thirty from each Pokemon and maybe make it where it's a little bit longer um, to try to deck about even more. And of course we can get back picnic basket with some other resources. Uh, two switch to get a Pokemon to the active. Uh, four Tempo Sino to disrupt the special energies. Two boss order. We already talked about this. Uh, one Silene. Flip two coins for each heads. Put a number, uh, put a card on top of your deck, right? And this can, you know, get back to picnic basket. The big thing is we'll get back to pal pad, which is great. Uh, you know, we'll talk about the pal pad combo here in a second. One Flannery discard special energy. It also discards a stadium, but guaranteeing the special energy is probably really good. Claire to get two Pokemon, two energies back into your hand, or both. Uh, Miriam to get five Pokemon back into your deck. One Piona, look at three price cards, put then put three back. Uh, three research, just go to your hand, all seven, trying to get set up, and one team yell share, shuffle three, a combination of Pokemon and supporter cards, except for team yell share, if you just swap back into your deck. So what you can do with this deck, is you can team yell share, put down, put back Silene, Silene then can put back Palpad, Palpad can put back the team yell share, Silene can also put down team yell share and Palpad, and the Palpad can put both of them back, so you have this like really cool combo, but the big thing is team yell share does not get back team yell, team yell share. Silene can get back Pal Pal, which guarantees you both the Silene and the Team Yell Share. And then Team Yell Share does guarantee the Silene, and Silene could maybe guarantee the Pal Pad. So you have like this loop of like, you're never going to deck out, and that's a pretty cool thing to say in this deck, right? And the six, Psych Energy. So that's Baynet, Spide Ops. Um, if you look at the previous videos, you can kind of see it. It's always been like on there because I've been like trying to tweak it all week. And I think this is where. We're going to end up at, and uh, hopefully today, yes, okay. So we do have matchmaking. Oh, players come through. Whew, it's going to be a hard one for sure. Um, 
No, like, you know, it's other ones, uh, other item locking decks like the Bicobolt or Scythe. So this one, I don't think it's like, I don't think this was that good. Let me be honest, I don't think it's as good as like Bicobolt or Scythe of Dota, of course. Uh, both idol locking decks that we've had before, um, you know, at one point in, in time, right? Uh, so I'm going with the coin flip. I'm going to go first. And I think our best matchup that we want to see is Mew. Like, Boss against Genesec is like probably is money. Uh, Kofi's is also something that we want to see. That could be a really good card to bring up. Um, so our hand is not ideal right now. It would be so for real. It's not that good. And they start a Squobit. Now, Squobit is perfect because, I mean, they can bite us, like, right? Like a bite, right? And there's RCSV. These decks might play Penny, which is like kind of tricky. Kind of tricky. It is definitely kind of tricky. Um, my only issue right now is we don't have another Sporter card, but we do, uh, another uh, Pokemon. But we do have Crush and Hammer. Crush and Hammer could flip heads, discard that double turbo, and make it where they can't retreat. And B Barrel has beat, B Diff has made an appearance. Which is great for us. B-Barrel is something that is very easy for us to knock out. Our regular up to the bench for the active. So that's good. A lot of a lot of re heavy retreat Pokemon have made appearances. So this is good. This is exactly what we want to see in this kind of deck, right? Uh, so our turn, we type. Okay, we do find this. Okay, we'll go for the Crushing Hammer. Whoo! Get out of here! Okay. And I think we're just going to pass. And uh, no, okay, we could Silene. But it'll be time to get the Crush Hammer, so I'm going to press Dumb right now. I don't want to play Silene. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. We could have maybe Ultra the Silene and Boss Order, but I want to Boss Order next turn just in case they uh, go for Switch Play. So this is a B Barrel coming down, okay? Uh, we can Switch Plus Boss Order next turn. And the most they can do right now is Trinity Charge if they have another double turbo in hand, but the RC's V Star tells it all. They are definitely not going to have some. I uh, mean, I guess they could. Hypothetically, go for like RC's V, Double Turbo, uh, Switch, and go about it that way. That could be really good. We hope we top deck. I mean, if we top deck a research, we can't go for Boss Order. Hmm. Maybe I should have thought about that. Maybe I should have like Ultra Ball these two, and if we top deck the research, we could at least go for the B Barrel. Ah, uh, because right now, we're trying to say, we're, we're with the Boss Order, like, yeah, it's cool, but. Hmm. We'll see. Dusty Shines is for five, up to five, sorry. Did they find the RC's V kind of combo? That'd be money for my opponent. Switch, RC's V, uh, RC's V, double turbo, Trinity Charge, or Trinity Nova. Not Trinity Nova, the other one's Trinity Charge. That's what we care about. Lightning to the RCS has made an appearance. That's good for us. And just pass under our turn, okay? So, Psychic, huh? Okay. Oh, that's, that's actually perfect. What am I talking about? Um, we're going to discard this and this. Because I want to keep this switch. Hmm. Yeah, I want to keep the switch. So this, this, psychic to the active, and let's start the party. All right, so now they can't play any item cards. They actually can't retreat the Squobit now because Squobit has a, uh, a true retreat cost. So, it's pretty nice. We can't take a knockout on the Squobit, and we might end up doing that. Like, RC is not going to one-shot us, so we should be okay. And then we could maybe go for a Poltergeist attack? Hmm. Depending on how many trainer cards in there, right? But we'll take a knockout next turn, and then we can use Echoing Horn Boss. Of course, we're going to probably bring up the B-Barrel. Okay, so there's the tr uh, Star Birth. Okay. So two cards go in their hand. Uh, I guess they could Penny the Squovid. If they pay Penny. Just always put a base Pokemon in your hand, whatever. So that could be something they could do here. So don't want to do the bench RCS, okay. What else do they have? Uh, 
Play a judge, I dare you. Okay, so they went for the boss play on this Spide Ops. Which is why I kept the switch. Interesting. Well, they have B Barrel, so I guess not really that interesting, I guess. Another RCs V, and then you just pass for. Oh, they're gonna incisors for five. Okay. Now, what if they don't play any switching cards? Well, they can still retreat this with the double turbo, though. That's the only problem. All right, so I'm going to switch it to Bayonet, hold the boss order, and just Everlasting Darkness for the knockout. I'm going down to five. Pal pad, okay. So RC's V-Star will come up. We can then boss order this B-Barrel and just start smacking it. There's b -doof, okay. Yeah, boss this up is probably our best play right now, of course. Trinity Nova, gonna put three, maybe on the, on the RCSV. Maybe they just do one. <laughs> There's one, two, three, okay. So we're gonna boss this up first. Then we're gonna start punching away. Okay, so it's our opponent's turn. Do they have another boss order? They can't play Serenity because we're a Pokemon EX, of course. Another B barrel. So this is great. So we can boss this up, bring this up to 90, and then and I boss this up as well. Uh, 369. Yeah, we at least hit this for a couple turns. So that's great. Path to the beat comes down. We don't care about that. Oh my goodness, they have the other boss. Okay. Industry tries this for two. Okay, another our turn. Yo, it's prize. No. Okay, there's the power pads in here, so that's good. Uh oh. Okay. My B doof is prized. That's not good. But can they find a switch? Or escape rope. If they go for escape rope, then I'm sending the shove it, of course. This guy does have a three retreat cost because of the spite ops. Nest ball, okay. Gonna fail it. Because they can't play item cards now because we didn't shuffle them. Incisors for one. Pass into our turn, okay. Whew, finally! Okay, so we can put this down. Put this down for this. No, we want this. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I almost misclicked there. I can Tempo of Sinnoh? Let's go Captured Aroma and Flip Tails. Perfect. So we're running the spite ops. Or not spite ops, the uh, tarantula. Yep. Okay. Put that down. Pass to our opponent's turn, unfortunately. Okay. <laughs> so they if they go for a double turbo play, they have to bump the stadium. So V guard to the active, okay. Pass to the peak. And sit down spite ops the X. A 
The Death Sea Shrine is for one. Okay. Hmm. Did not find any supporter cards. Flannery would be really good right now. Like, Flannery plus discard, like, the double turbo. So, trading the number one, eight to get to not take a knockout. Okay. Oh, no. Our turn. What do we get? We get Nestball for another Shuppet. Put it on the Spot Ops EX. And have to pass, unfortunately. Okay. This is not looking good. Okay, okay, okay. We both bosses are in the discard pile. We did not. We are not able to get down the B barrel, which is pretty bad. So changing down for the knockout. Okay. Hmm. I guess we set up the bayonet. Uh, yep. I mean, I can't play Nest Ball. Unfortunately, I don't get anything with it. It's not getting the B barrels like hurting me right now. Hmm. Another Trinity Nova. Okay. <laughs> it was like a B barrels in the deck would be golden. Okay, I think we're gonna lose this. I'm like pretty confident we've lost the game. Oh yeah, we'll press in a turn. Uh man. Okay. That that ball sorta from them was like so clutch. Do they have any more ball swords? I mean, they probably do, right? Hmm. I have to set up my... I have to set up this thing. Okay. So, picnic basket. I don't think there's anything on my deck that I care about to grab. I guess we'll grab a shuffle. it. I'll play research. Go for Pecknick back so again. I don't think the 30 is like gonna matter, unfortunately. Get Tippo Sino. Attach per turn pass, unfortunately. Energy boss is game, pretty much. Yep. Show me the ball sorter. Okay, so no ball sorter. Okay. So you have a one retreat cost. Interesting. Hammer? Cool. I think I have to go for Peona here, which is not ideal at all. Okay. Mm hmm. Um. Uh... Yeah, I don't know what we could do. We did find our B doof again. We picked the wrong cards. Hmm. Haven't found our second pal pad either to bring up the B barrel. Yeah, it was like cool that we found our ball starters early, but then like. Okay, that's game. 
Cool, 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 cool. Like a good matchup, if we. I don't want to say bad price cards. What? That was black cards. What, what just happened there? Man, that was unfortunate. Oh, man. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try this again. That was unfortunate. Yeah, if our B diff wasn't prized, I think it would be like in a really good, really good spot. Uh, hitting the pal pad early and double boss order was like really unfortunate too. So, I mean, that's a good matchup. That's definitely a matchup you want to hit. You want to hit the Arceus. For sure. So. Inferno. Inferno Maker 1. Okay. Call heads. Well, we won the coin flip, okay. Yeah. Hmm. Not a good hand. Have both our switch in our hand. Okay. Hmm. That's a good starter for us. It makes me think it's Arceus. They would do these two. Like, Hammer can be so clutch next turn. Oh, they're in there. All right, we need a top deck, though. We need a top deck. I think it's Arceus Giratina by the Giratina Slaves. Giratina's made an appearance. There's Arceus. Arceus double turbo. Okay, another Ultra Ball. This could go for like a Lamenion or something. That could be really good for us. Nope, another Arceus V. Okay. Arceus V Research. Yo, bro. My opponent is just starting with the research. Double throw to the bench. Switch. Guillotine V. Got the switch. Squove it. Got the switch. Show the switch. Okay. Just pass in our turn, okay? Crushing hammer. All right, so they can't knock us out next turn. So we'll switch into Shup It. I probably should attach this energy, but whatever. Well, yep, that's fine. We flip heads. They can't play trainer cards. Ooh, <laughs> we're three for three on heads right now. Okay. So they can't go for like a switch, double turbo kind of. Play. They could go for a penny play if they want to. Okay. Hopefully they judge us here. If you judge us, I'll be so happy upon it. That's not a judge. RC's V Star. They can't play Switch though, because we use our shadow. Starbirth, show me the penny, and I will be so happy. They can't take a knockout either way. No matter what, they can't take a knockout this turn. There's nothing they can do to take a knockout. 100% positive. 99.99% positive, I guess. Because there's always a, there's if there's a will, there's a way, right? But I don't think the cards exist in their deck to do that. Selected cards here. What they got? What they got? What you got, an opponent? Okay, two cards go in their hand. 
Bidoof has made an appearance. Judge, 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 judge. Research. Yo, what the heck? Okay. Guillotine V Star. Okay. What's our top deck? Another RC's V Star. Okay. All right, Captain Aroma. Let's go! <laughs> We're getting so lucky right now. Okay. So we're done the bayonet EX. And we'll swing. That's fine. Get out of here. Perfect. We might not have supporter guards, but we are getting extremely lucky here. Grass to the RC's V-Star. And what they got. What does my opponent have here? Now, unfortunately, Path to Peak does shut off Spider Up CX. That's pretty annoying. Okay. Pass on our turn. Okay. Capturing Aroma Tails this time? Give me a Tails. Perfect. Because I want to find B Doof. I want to find the B Doof, hit the B Barrel, and start cooking. So we'll, we'll take a knockout this turn, unfortunately. We'll, we'll take a knockout. Get a, get, we're not attached to the energy Pokemon. Stop telling me to. So take a knock, I got out of five. It's not what I wanted. RC's V star comes up. Let me top deck Ultra Ball and I'll be so happy. That does what, 30 more to Psychic? Yep. Let's go! Judge has made an appearance. Ah! <laughs> it's so bad. How does this keep happening to me? <sighs> so Poultry Guys is max going to do 6, 12, 18. Okay, only do 180 next turn, like a max. So that's scary. The net slash for one? Yo. Okay. We get tip of Sinnoh, cross our fingers. One, two. Cool. All right, on our turn. Okay, well, Nest Ball for a Shuppet at least. Put down Spider Ops EX. Play down Tip of Sinnoh. We'll see what happens. They can't retreat this now because there's a three retreat cost. The net slash. Oh man, they don't have any energy. Oh, let's go. Okay. Now the spider up CX is not. <coughs> it's not what we want to see, but it's what we have. Another net slot for one. Woohoo! We're still kicking it to alive! Oh, there's the B 
Beaver, let's go! Beaver's made an appearance finally! And Dusty Sizers for two. Whew, we get Picnic Basket. Let's go for another... Oh, man! Okay! They still got the Squobit. Don't forget the Squobit. Okay, another Squobit's coming down. Let's go. Got the hammer. No. Okay. I guess we're B-Barrel for one, guys. Another hammer. Let's go. Get out of here, double turbo. All right, go for another. Oh, man, dude. Whew. <laughs> so now they need a counter stadium and a double turbo now. They're all, oh, they got the B barrel. <gasps> uh, okay, I'm nervous. Okay, they're going for the squib at first. It's dust your sizes for four. They are down two double turbos. What card is that? Oh no, they cheated! You cheated! Woohoo! Get out of here! Okay, they do have the loss on two energies though. So that's big. They have the loss on two energies. They still got a loss on two energies. That doesn't change anything. Like. Yeah, they're the loss impact for a knockout, but like they're down so many energies. <sighs> That's unfortunate. <sighs> so unfortunate. I'm starting to get nervous, but like, mm, I don't know. They gotta find the double turbos. That's what that's where the money is. They gotta find the double turbos. One of the active and one of the okay. Okay, we chillin'. Get in there, squib it or shove it. I can only team yell chair for one. I can team yell chair for these two. Sorry. Then I can pal pad in the Team Yell's chair. Then I can industrial sizers for two. And then cry. You're coming out, Pumpkaboo. Okay. So when they take a knockout this turn, they're gonna go down to uh, man, they play switch now. They they're play they what they need to do is switch into double turbo and sack with RC's V Star. Because if they attack with the gear team in the active, they'll loss on two more energies, and then they won't be able to swing. Um, so that's kind of... I, mean, I guess they could put double turbo on the active and swing, and they'll be good to go that way. So Grenade hasn't made an appearance. Okay. Bro, we were doing so good. And then we didn't hit anything. We didn't find any more of our guys. We haven't played any... Okay, we haven't played any supporter card. Outside, <laughs> outside of Team Yell's cheer, you gotta be kidding me, Judge. Oh, thank you, opponent. You are my best friend. Okay, let's go. Cleansing gloves, sure. Pal pad. Okay, so they lost on two cards, like I said. <laughs> yeah, I think they're gonna run out of energy. I'm gonna be real honest with you guys. So one, two. 
That gets knocked out. They go down to three. We'll send up B barrel. Ona our turn. We'll go shop it. Ultra Bowl. One and two to find a second shop it. We'll go shop it and Dusty incisors. Rest. All right, that's fine. Oh no, it's not fine, Josh. This is not fine, actually. Okay, hopefully they boss and knock out, like, the spider ops, and I gotta shove it or something like that. Now, if they don't have a, if they don't have a double turbo here, and a counter stadium, we're actually in a really good spot. Why would they do that play? They don't have a way to energy, like move chance energies though. How many switch have we played? One switch. Okay, we'll go shove it. Shove it. Psychic and dusty incisors. We found the switch. Let's go. Ultra Ball the two. Okay. How many? Any, I think. Is there any hammers left on deck? There's not. Okay. Spider Ops into research. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're fine with this. So we're gonna item lock them. But they haven't played any boss yet. Well, they played one, they played one boss. My plan is to boss up the RC's V Star on the bench. This is still not enough energy. They need a counter stadium. How many paths to peak the peaks, the peaks are they playing? So we're about to boss up this RC's V Star. And yeah, just start going at it. It's kind of what we want to see now. We got to the active. Hmm. Industrial sizers. Okay. Can they hypothetically never duck out? Oh my goodness. The double Sharon's care. Sure. <laughs> the double Sharon's care. You gotta be kidding me. Right? Oh, no, they pal it back. They pal it back. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay. I'm about to say, dude, you... There's no way. <sighs> Put 
Put down Tip of Sinnoh. Use Piona. Oh, that's so unfortunate. I think we might. I there's a big possibility we're gonna lose. Yep. They do need. They they do need another counter stadium. Okay, or they can attach another V guard. Sure, <laughs> dude, you gotta be kidding me! Oh, the V guard from the freaking um, yeah, 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 yeah. I know what it's from. I know, I know, I know, dude. Okay, we did hit psychic, but I don't know what we could do after that. One, two, three, four. Like, I can't play Silene because we don't have enough energy. We, we don't get... I mean, I could. No, Silene doesn't work that way either. Oh, I don't think there's anything we could do. Yeah, there's nothing we could do. I mean, I could research, but there's nothing left in my deck. This is what I needed. Oh, then they retreat to Giratina and knock out. Man. Like, probably our best matchup, and we just didn't hit the right cards at the right time. Wow. 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 I hate, I hate. Oh, my God. There's the boss order, too. Do then I have the the path to the peak? I don't have the path to the peak. Okay. What? I can't see. I want to see. What? I can't see all my cards in my deck. Oh, was it just like. Nest balls are left. Okay. Does that put them in any order or no? Uh-huh. Sure. Are we going to win? OK. 
Okay, we'll press, we'll end our turn. I think we might deck out our opponent. Well, I don't know, because they're going to be able to squirrel it plus B bear overturn. So we for sure get Silene next turn. Hmm. Okay. We might make a run out of timer, technically, and win. Oh, we lose. 100% we lose now. I don't think there's a way we can get out of this now. Oh my gosh, they hit the pa Oh my, the whole time they had an escape rope. I'm sitting over here enjoying life. Flip double tails, like we lose. We lose because we deck out. And he's like, nope, just kidding. I have escape rope the whole time. What a roller coaster of emotions. What a roller coaster. I mean, we lost either way because we flipped double tails on Silene. We'd had to flip at least like one, right? Oh, goodness. But then like, the Squirrel plus B-Barrel is like the infinite combo to never deck out. Yo, they played everything to counter my deck. Everything. Oh! Mmm. Well. Well, what a great Friday. Hope you had a great Friday. We're doing the Road Tuesday week. We might see Spidey Ops CX come back and play like in Leafeon, like other people do. Uh, play Spidey Ops and Leafeon, blah, blah, blah. So, we'll see. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I had fun. Hope you had fun watching me losing. We'll see you on Monday. Have a great weekend. If you're going to Portland, if you're not, good luck at your couple of challenges. Alrighty, bye.